Army Fire Dog is back again. How have y'all been? Today I actually have an unboxing video of a prequel to a product that I reviewed previously. If y'all remember my very um, enjoyed Sound Pete's Q32, this is actually their, I guess, younger model, and this is their Q12. Instead of being a true wireless, this is just a traditional wireless earphone. I'm excited to see if it's the same sound or what the difference is between the Soundpeats Q12 and its higher packaged Q32. But without further ado, let's just jump into the unboxing, shall we? And let's just see what's involved. Alright, so starting with the package itself, it's very, very simplistic as the previous Soundpeats earphones was. All you have is the product itself on the front, a little explanation on the side about its, you know, it's, it's saying. And then on the back, even not too bad on the back, it just has a couple features it wants to highlight. It's like it's new, up-to-date Bluetooth 5 and it's water resistance. Now, a few of you have asked me what the difference between water resistance and waterproof is. Well, waterproof is exactly what it says. It's waterproof. It can be submerged. Uh, traditionally, it's uh, three feet for 30 minutes. That's traditionally what they go by. Um, showers won't hurt. It, it can be submerged. That's essentially what waterproof is. Water resistance, such as this right here, means that it's essentially resistant to like sweat. Or if you're working out, like out running outside and it starts to rain, as long as it doesn't get into the actual driver unit itself through the horn, traditionally, you should be just fine. But I personally am looking for a workout product. This right here is exactly what I look for. Now, opening the package itself, So as you can see, the presentation itself is very impressive for a product at this price point. Like things are centered. Uh, has right here says the accessories inside. I like seeing that. I mean, it's not really a thing. It's, it just it, it just looks nice. It's a good presentation. Move that aside. So underneath the nice hard case, you have the owner's manual and instruction guidebook. And then like a little calling card for, you know, what the Sound Pete's is, um, extended warranty and stuff like that. Inside the case, you have the actual product itself. And actually, this is very reminiscent of the Dudios Zeus uh, I am I reviewed not too long ago that I was very and I'm still to date impressed by I still actively use those I am's myself I personally am a fan of this style of wireless over the true wireless There's nothing bad or worse for either one. It's just a personal preference I just like to have this cable around. I think it's more secure for me personally But you still have those magnetic attachments inside you have its micro USB charging cable I do hope to see that this advances to a USB-C very, very soon, but it is what it is. In the accessories tab, we have a big old plethora of different tips and clips here. So we have, I hope my camera can pick this up, it's all black and it's kind of a shady background. So we have your singular, this is kind of like the bud style horn. Um, see if I can focus it for you all. See how there's no actual tip that goes in your ear? It's just a, uh, a flat surface. That is what's called a bud. So when someone says an ear bud, this is what it's referring to. It's a flat piece versus an IEM, a tip to it, or similar uh, horn or flange. You have a D-ring and two clips, and then just various other tips as well. Um, but guys, that is actually it for the unboxing video of the Soundpeats Q12. Like I said, this is the younger sibling of the Q32 True Wireless IEMs that I reviewed almost a year ago. In fact, I reviewed them during my last annual training. So I'm really excited to try these out. I have some really good workouts. Now that finally it's getting warm weather, hopefully the rain dies down some, so I am really excited to try this out. But guys, if you have any questions or if there's anything I may have missed that you would like me to clarify more, please hit me up in the comments down below. I know I've been a bit inactive. It's that time of year. Uh, things just really start slowing down, but hopefully it'll start picking up. 
but don't worry, I still will listen to, read, and reply to all of your comments. I do enjoy hearing and reading them. I guess more reading, I don't really get voice ones. But anywho, guys, as always, my name is Army Firedog. It has truly been a pleasure, but most importantly, and please I ask of you, my friends, stay safe.